Welcome back everybody to the next episode of Star Ocean Till the End of Time. Now, I know we've made it to the Sacred City of Aquios, and I know we're supposed to go hang out with the Queen, and I know that we're going to do something else. So, you all saw that I was visibly upset. Okay, you didn't see that. You heard me be annoyed that we lost... Roger. And so I reached out to someone else. I was like, hey, I have to know. Does Roger come back? Just yes or no? And they were like, yeah. And I was like, can I get Roger back now? Or do I have to wait? And they're like, you could now. And I was like, okay, I want the spoilerinos. Because Roger is a lower level. And so if I'm going to get them back in the party eventually, why not do it now instead of later? You know, so they can actually raise the level. So get to Paterni and go west. And now they said something like, hey, just be careful with those birds. And I was like, oh, that is where I have to go. Understood. And they're like, oh, did you run into them before? I'm like, yeah, I ran into these birds before. So we're going to have to avoid them. Because uh, they're very scared. They're like, oh, were you trying to get the rabbit? And I was like, of course I was trying to get the rabbit. I always try to get the rabbit. Um, so I really shouldn't be doing that right now. Um, <laughs> but apparently I need to go here. What is this? I don't care. I don't know. Run away. Like, seriously, run away. Let's get out of here for now. They escape at different rate. Also, there was only one harpy. I feel maybe, maybe I could have attacked. Could have been neat. So we are now at the lost city of Sephirio. Oh my goodness, it's a fairy. Hello, Flower Woman. Welcome, human person. Welcome, human person. This is the town of Sephirio, gateway to the Sem Sanmite Republic. Thanks. Well, this is neat. Any hidden items? No? Okay, I like it, though. It's very neat. Um, so an item shop. Welcome to my shop. The fairy tier... What the hell was that in the water? What's this? A human person? I see. Welcome to my shop. I've got plenty of item salvage from under the waves. What does lavender do? Uh, cures freezing. Sure, we'll just have a few of those. You don't carry much, but that's okay. Hello? Ma Hello? Hello? Okay, they don't want to talk to me. Fine. Now let's see if we can get a look in the water, because there was something. Oh, there's a lot of somethings. Is that a person? Those people? Damn. Uh, on and off. Off on a trip. Don't worry, I'll be back sometime or another. Hmm. Oh my god, it's a mermaid. I saw him. I saw a mermaid. Marshall. Marshall, what are you doing here? Oh, hey. I was like looking right at it. Machinery stuff. I still haven't read anything on <laughs> crafting yet. I'll. I'll get there. I'll get there. <laughs> Look who it is. Thank you, Dustbin. Yo. Sorry, is that one guy a mage? Oh, it's you guys. Great to see ya. I want to recruit all of them, replace the entire party with them. Hmm. Melt. Hey, who are these guys? Tribe. These guys are trying to be my henchmen. I guess that'd make them your underlings or something. No. Huh? You're joking. Come on, Roger, tell the truth. Yeah, Roger, tell the truth. Do it. Do it. Sorry, 
just kidding. I had them help out in the real man contest a while back. Oh, okay then. <laughs> I thought there was something funny going on. These guys seem pretty strong and all. We are. The name's Fate Line Guard. Nice to meet you. Cliff Fitter. Mel Zelda. Howdy! Nice to meet you guys. I'm Drive. I'm one of Roger's crew. I'm Mel. So you guys were the ones helping Roger. Mm hmm <laughs> Don't bother speaking. I see all and know all. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, this guy can read the stars just a little. He says weird things sometimes, but don't let that bother you. Okay. Wow, the ability to read the stars. What are you guys doing? Hey, I just found this awesome item. Hey, you didn't find that. Galoro of the Green Tribe found it. Galoro of the Green Tribe. You fool! You didn't have to tell him that. This is it. A book? That's right. A mysterious book dug from the ruins of the bottom of a lake. It just reeks of adventure! But I don't really understand what it says. <laughs> you don't understand what it says? I don't know these characters. Only Mel can read it. And even he doesn't understand the whole thing. All I know is it seems to be talking about a certain place. Yeah, I can't read this stuff. What does it say? Hidden spring in a sea of rolling white fog. What will the stalwart father and son understand guard them? Hmm. Caves as dark as death. The five attributes come into conflict. What light can reveal them? The rotted corridor, guarded by archers of the gods. The sun king sleeps in his coffin. What shall the mute corpse say? Which of the three shall claim the kingly's throne? Does the sacrifice of the winged messenger of the gods gaze at hope or despair? At the end of the caverns where the copper sleeps, the northernmost wise man gazes upon the lake. Is it an ancient tower sealed below the roofs? Burning flames of the underworld. The red long. twins, looked down upon by the giant from the tribe of long years. Who can release that inner power? That's all of it. Mm, I don't get it. What's it talking about? All I know is, it sounds like a bunch of riddles telling you where to find stuff. Agreed. Where are we so? Guess all we can do is go on an adventure and find out. No, are you kidding? It's dangerous. Well, of course it is. Adventure's gotta be dangerous. I hate danger. Mm. Oh, you gutless wonder. You call yourself a man? But it said burning flames of the underworld. <laughs> This'll be nothing but trouble. Right. You guys help me out here. What? I said help me. And in return, I'll help you guys out on your adventures too. Yes, please. Yeah, but... What's wrong with that? All you gotta do is help out with our treasure hunt while you're on your own adventure. So what'll it be? Hell yeah, brother. I'll leave it up to you. Cooperate. Alright, you've got a deal. Brother. Yep. He's in your hands now. Oh, I'm so glad we got him back. Thank you, Dustbin. Thank you. And I'll see you guys then. I'll pick up some presents for you guys too. Don't worry. Oh, it's nice. Laters. I do hope we can get him a weapon though. He's like he's quite weaker. Maybe this uh, town sells an axe of sorts. Um <laughs> Well now, that was interesting. 
nice glasses. A book of riddles describing places. Guess I'll go tell my excitable young boy about that right away. My excitable young boy. What? Who are you? What the hell? Are you standing on a frog? The frog is walking. That is adorable. Ancient book one, obtain. Ancient book two, obtain. Ancient book three, obtain. Ancient book four, obtain. Ancient book five, obtain. Ancient book six, obtain. Ancient book seven, obtain. Who else went out of breath there? Um. So I assume they are all different. Yeah, they're different things. Okay, okay, that's pretty neat. So I guess I can just leave and can get back to what I was doing. Oh, hi, Goblin. Drow, drow, Drowglin boy. Hurt, bad human. Gather luck, leak, wither. C -c -c -c. Okay. Oh, hi. Smithery, smithy materials. And that's why you break into people's homes, ladies and gents, so you can get stuff. Hello. Lewis the Diviner. Heh, young people these days are worthless and weak. When I was young, people worked so hard they didn't even want to sleep. Well, that sounds terrible, person. I wouldn't want to live in your time. That sounds crappy. Back in my day, we all worked 25 hours a day. Good for you. Oh, clean, so nice. I love cleaning up. You should totally come to my place. I am not a fan. Like, I, I don't live in squalor, but I don't enjoy the cleaning process. I just do it because I don't want things to smell bad. That's literally my motivation, because I don't want things to smell bad. Bones are hard and vegetables stick together. Human cuisine is really, really, really hard. Hee hee hee. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh. They're like Dilly the Lousid. <laughs> what a cute kid you are. What is what is a human doing in these parts? Uh changing his party up. That's what. I think I'll let Cliff go for a minute. Cause he kind of gets in the way. Um he doesn't, sorry, he doesn't get in the way. He like uh, he he ruins things for me when I'm trying to you know um, do stuff. He's like, oh, bro, put him down. You flutter over here and you flutter over there. Can't you just calm down for a moment? If you don't relax a little, one of these days you'll trip and fall into the water. Is this the water particularly bad? This is an inn. It's blue. I think the inns were blue. Village chief's hoose. Oh. Oh. Let me through! I do like this music a lot. I love that patch they're using for, um, um, for the keyboard. It's really lovely. It's the kind of synth I enjoy a lot. The Moselle Dunes lie up ahead. Those who wilt easily should turn back now. Well, I wilt easily. Um, I don't think I should go there yet. I'm really starting to think this is like the only planet we're going to be on. Or, maybe not that, but like a planet we're going to be on for a while. Which, if that's the case, that's fine. Um, I just, I, I kind of thought we were going to do a lot more planet hopping, but I guess we don't exactly have a, a space boat. No way, what? Roger actually went to feed a band of thieves? Of course, that's a lie. A big liar. A, a big liar like that. A real man? Don't make me laugh. I mean, he did do it. Oh. Oh, it's you. Um, can you get out of the way so I can talk to that person? Por favor. Seriously. Get out of the way. I see a treasure chest. And I want it. Liz <gasps> Lizard? No. Sorry, I know that name from Radiata Stories. The way things have turned out, I have to implement a new plan, but I have so many effective plans to choose from, honestly, I find it uh, difficult to pick one. <laughs> I'm so good, I kind of scare myself. Shut up, Lizard, you jerk. Ass. 
House. Little guys, adventure journal, date journal, 100 selected dinner. Ooh, dinners. Oakberries. Well, Oats is bringing me home. Um, she's out with a friend right now, who lives in an area a bit far away from home, and she's bringing me home uh, upon me. I'm very excited. Very excited. Um, hopefully we can. Get out of here without incident. Ooh, we're not far from finishing the map, though, you know? Know what I mean? Ladders and gentles, mans. Know what I mean? Yeah? You're picking up what I'm putting down, huh? Huh? Yeah, yeah we're gonna, gonna try it, maybe? Okay, up there. Don't touch me! It will hurt my face. Don't touch me with your claws of injustice. Ah. My own rabbit. Um, went up here. Maybe I can. That's probably a. Yeah. Oh, it's a blueberry. Nice. Nice. Um, what am I missing? Maybe over yonder. Must have been full. Interesting. Interesting. Get away from me. Get away! Right, maybe it's like just some random little corner. Because I was like, oh, well, we're not going to finish it, so why bother? You know? Holy smack doolies, Batman. Bad touch, bad touch. Ooh, down here, maybe? A little bit, a little bit. Um, maybe, maybe over here. I don't know. Uh, but ladies and gentlemen, I am going to do that grinding that I spoke about earlier. I'm probably going to go to the forest to do it. I felt that was a pretty good place, but, um... I will see you all in a moment after I do some grinding. Alrighty, folks, and we are back. Um, I know we're kind of in a weird spot. I did do some grinding. Like I said, I got Roger up to 19, and Nell also got up there. A uh, cool thing to make it to where people didn't get, like, super overly messed up, like, overboard. Um, like, I was able to swap out Cliff and Fade at different times for, for Nell to ensure that there's kind of a a uh, kind of evenness now he did learn some new things he got charged which has actually been really handy also whirling heat which i'll show off and landmines which is super duper cool so i um didn't grind on these things by the way i actually surprise surprise went back so here's landmines you just run around and you slowly drop them it's really nifty but check this out Check this out. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah! <laughs> so if they run into them, they, uh... They, uh... Bam! I love that one. It, like, it'll, it makes them spin around. Watch. It's going to make them spin. If it doesn't die, that is. But, um, obviously I have a lot of great bonuses going on right now, which is lovely. But I went back to that harpy area. Remember, I was like, oh my god, I'm going to die. Um, and instead, I avoided the harpies because they were too hard, but the little dodo-looking birds... Let me see, is there a beast tree in this game? Uh, not really. We need to go in there, by the way, and really check it out. Is there really not a beast tree? Huh. 
Dang, I really need to do another lore episode, don't I? But yeah, they just look like little like dodos. And they were actually pretty easy. And with my bonus, if I killed three of them, I got 690 experience per. So that was a really great way to help level folks up. I have been just continuously using Roger. Really do enjoy him uh, combat-wise. Obviously, as a character, he can be a bit, um, a bit much. <laughs> but, you know, that's okay. Also, I do want to give him support back. So I might get rid of this. That will allow him to heal in combat again. I'm going to go into Symbology and turn some stuff off. That way, he'll only use these. I don't need Fate using Lightning Blast. I need him to save his MP for something like um, uh, Fire Sword. So these are good, I think. So mastery is 197. That's awesome, I guess. Um, yeah, and so we're going to continue on with the story now, which I'm really excited about. Um, hopefully you are a two, but we're also going to just kind of explore this city because that's what we always do when we come to a new town. We are in Armor, Armor Arrhenia's Hammer. Okay, and you right here. You got anything good to sell? Yes, what can I do for you? I hope you can sell me some good new stuff. Do you have a frickin' axe? Dang it, we don't. Um, yes, a battle axe! A battle axe! A oh, these are the things I made. Also, I've done some looking stuff up on, you know, the, uh, the uh, crafting, so I understand now. Let's do this. Let's just buy it all at this point. We've made a good chunk of money. You'll see I have 38000 So that was really nice. I made some good, like I said, I made some good money um, doing that grind as well. Because you get double full eventually. So let's see. Um, heavy armor will up him a good amount. Very good, very good. Uh-huh. And uh-huh. But the Tromit of Muth... From 154 to 206. That's what I was hoping for. That big old big chungus kind of, you know, increase. Let's chat to people in this town, see what they're up to. Lady Rogue Louise, Captain the Demon Hunter Legion, uses the very same um, same greaves sold in this shop. Sir Astor Wolfric of the Secret Legion uses the very same helmet sold in this shop. Lady Crescenta Sharuma of the Void... Oh, I'm, I'm reading a thing. Most of the... Most of the more useful weapons have been taken to the front of Arius. All that's left now are the expensive ones. Um, I, are there ones I'm not seeing? Those weren't very expensive, but I guess that's a relative term. Although protecting the sacred city, uh, protecting the sacred city is a very important duty. I feel so impotent when I have to stay here, away from the battlefield. It's such a cruel time, crucial time. Michelle. Grown-ups really have it so easy. It's tough being a kid my age when you have to study day after day. Oh God. I miss when I thought that was hard. Like, those were good times. Because I would give a whole bunch to... for that to be the hard part. You know, like, studying in elementary... in, in, in university was tough. But, like, I, I thought... I, I really thought, like, middle school was hard. Like, high school obviously got tough, but, like, middle school was more of the social part. I would never want to go back to that, though. Um... Durna's Breath. Oh, an Outfitter. An Outfitter. Welk! Oh, an Energetic Girl. What up? Compounding Elixirs. Uh, Silver Ring. I... Oh, okay. Ups Defense. Clone Generator. I'll, I'll take one. Basil. You Cure Paralysis. I have ten of you. Sage Lavender. Ooh, Fresh Sage. Yeah, we had some deaths. <laughs> um... Winking Sage Cider. I believe I made some of that. Rattan. Oh. Oh. So that so I've been told use food outside of battle because you can't use it in battle. So it's a good way to actually have like 40 of something. So this is basically the, the fresh sage. That's good to know. Not by that much. Super potion. What is this? Pokemon? It petrifies an enemy. I did not expect that at all. Um cool. Okay. Um, oh, okay, it's just the same place. Um, I can't tell by that sign what this place would be at all. It's a workshop, okay. Um, 
don't no, does it have it does it has cooking compounding and crafting so let's see cooking compounding and what was it crafting 35 okay so we could craft something so oh Nell's good at cooking all right all right so I'm gonna put you up front and then everyone else is helping so 20 and 15 um, so what I'm looking for is okay we're gonna craft that's what I'm doing right yes so here plan original invention 14 okay so now I'm gonna look for when um, Roger is smiling so it could be the first one could be the 15th one okay that's not good that's not good that's also not good apparently they can fall asleep didn't know that okay that's also not good come on come on Roger you can do this you can do this okay but Nell is smiling huh I'm tempted to just, after, like, if I see three more. Because, like, again, the other two are smiling, but Roger is not. So does he have to be the one to be happy? I'm going to give it one more go. And if it doesn't, if I don't see him smile, I'm going to finish it. Yeah, I'm going to finish it. Request submission. Oh, so we did. Oh, attacky earring. Rare, highly fi uh, finished earring that is strangely unfashionable. Impossible to salvage the design. It would be better to just start over from scratch. Wow. Okay. Um, let's try one more like this. Original. Oh, 294. Let's. I'm gonna save state this because we can get some nasty money loss. Okay, they all smiled. Except for Roger. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Yes, Onk of Dismissal has the ability to exercise evil, designates an enemy no XP award. Oh, interesting. Interesting. So now I want to make some food. Um, your cooking is two. Yours is 16 and yours is nine. So you're a little better than Roger. Uh, but again, we want the top one at the start. Cooking original invention for 41. Um, let's do it. Let's do it. So I guess the mini, if I see like five smiles, that means I'll make five of whatever it is. Okay, so that's one. What did I make? Oh, chopped steak. That is lovely. Probably 50% health and uh, heal. That's amazing. Okay, 41. Is that also chopped steak? Okay, she didn't smile. Oh, she's chopping like a boss. That is a good... That's not quite a smile, is it? No. Just let it get one or two more. Come on, come on, come on. Someone give me a smile. Come on. I want to succeed with my face. Status check. Oh. One more. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You can do it. You can do it. No. Come on. I believe in a thing called burrito salad. Nothing. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. So try this again and yes we're gonna be so so it said 41 so I could just do this I guess but I have to oh hey look at that like hey make rotten 384 nope <laughs> 21 sure let's do this let's do this and then we're gonna move on then we're going to move on when we go back to um, Paterni, though, that's where we're going to try to make some weapons. Hey, okay, nothing yet. Nothing yet. Okay, there we go. There we go. So I got to press X, not abort. Ooh! Ooh, my boy, six. A snack for, uh, food originating in the Terran Planetary Administrative District of Japan that has been popular for hundreds of years. Corn potage flavor. 30% HP recovery. How much does it take to make that on purpose? 101? Hmm. Por qué? 
Maybe it's like when it's a mystery, it's cheaper. You don't quite know what you're doing. I wonder if that's the case. Hmm. So I wonder if, if any of them smile, if that counts. Well, none of them have smiled yet. Come on, Nell, you can do this. Come on. And also the way I've learned it works is Nell will get 50% of the experience and the other two will get a quarter each. If I only had two, she would get two thirds and the other person would get a third. The top person always gets the most, which I think is neat. I do think that is neat. Can we get a freaking win? Like, we're just making something that we've already made. What? Oh, oops. What? No, I wanted the same thing. Why are you making new things? I wanted that. Ugh, whatever. Okay, guys, I'm leaving. Um, here's an item. C cooking ingredients. Perfecto. Perfecto. Go in here, check it out. Um, someone's playing chess. I see you. I see you hiding. I don't need you. Oh, ballistics, Batman. What am I going to do with them? What am I going to do with them, folks? Like, you you tell me. Do I just go out and be like, hey, poison me, foos? Crap berries? Um, yeah, let's, let's do this side first. Uh, make sure we can see stuff in case there's anything hiding in... Oh, that's pretty. Don't worry, I saw this. <laughs> yeah, they go. Ooh, synthesis materials. That's that sounds pretty good. I've, been, I've read up on synthesis a little bit too, so I have an idea of it. But I obviously want to practice with it. Become a master merchant. The armor hailed as a hero. Top 100 world map. What? Top 100 world maps. How to get your bearing? Z oh, that's cool. Look at that. You get a little bit of elevation. I was able to find a house to rent, but I don't know what to do about Missy. I wonder how long it'd be before she can return to her parents' house. Missy. Hmm. I wonder if that'll be something to um, learn about later. Go up there in a moment. Let's go on this side of the town first. Ooh, hello, neat hair, Eliza. It must be my mother's influence. I've always found runologists work fascinating. Once I grow up, I want to study many things, but I've given up on such ideas completely. The reason is I have an infant brother, and studying requires a considerable sum of money. In short, we don't have the means for such luxuries. Show her 10,000 full? I mean, I'm going to do both. I'm curious. Well, let's do the douche nozzle one first. I'm a very rich man. Oh my, I've never seen this much money before. Oh, wait. Oh. Sure. Give her ten grand. Wow, that hurts. I didn't know you were, uh, you and your friends were rich, Fate. With this money, I can study hard and invent lots of things. Oh, oh, she's an inventor. That's so cool. Very cliff. Um... Paterni. Let's go to. I feel like I'm gonna make Paterni. Oh, actually, you already have three things. I mean, you also have three things. I could. I mean, this is a major city. Maybe I'll have her stay here. Hello, Eliza. How are you? The inventor Eliza has signed with. That's so cool. I accidentally. Guys, I did it. I recruited somebody. Hooray! Um, slow paced woman may tell us that we're at war, but what can we really do? Offering our verbal support for Her Majesty and the Runologists is the best we can offer. I mean, sometimes, you know, if the best you can do is moral support, then support them morally. Orally. TikTok. Torally! Don't support them on TikTok. Compounding elixirs. Really? Oh, interesting. Too many compounding elixirs. Okay, okay. Um. Hello. 
Professor's assistant. Oh dear, Professor Pierre got away again. He writes so awfully slow, I better go find him. Heckin' Pierre. Hate that guy in Chrono Cross. He's terrible. Just terrible. But he does have the cat thing for um, entering Viper Manor, so it's pretty cool. Look at that! Frickin' the things, uh, reflections. I don't understand that boy across the way. All he does is idle about the house day after day. If he keeps that up, he'll never marry. What, what business is it yours? 1800 bucks. Alright, we got some of our money back. I guess, yeah, that chair blocks the way. I was like, man, giving away 10 grand is going to hurt, but we got something out of it, so that's really cool. Um, another synthesis material. Heck yes, brother. Huh? Who are you? Oh, oh, sorry. I shouldn't have come in here without permission. We're travelers from a faraway land. You people? Travelers? I don't believe it. Anyone in this company of Lady Nell Zelfer of the Crimson Blade cannot be a mere traveler. After all, she is a commander serving directly under Her Majesty and the pride of Aquaria. You must have an important mission. Oh, please, please tell me what it is. Here, just, just whisper it in my ear. I know. You're on such an important mission that you can't tell another living soul. I understand. I shall not question you any further. <laughs> That was actually really fun. Blackberries! Oh, I thought I was full on those. I can actually go up the stairs. Oh, look at that! You can actually see down below. Can we see him? Nah. That's, that'd be cool, though. Uh, so there are three beds in here. So he's got some family. Okay, okay. Or roommates. I don't know. I don't know. Um. Oh, it's a dog. Oh, yeah, that's a tail. But that was like a, a big old ear. Brown faced girl. After you get married, I wonder if it's better to get a job yourself or have your husband get a job. Hmm, what do you think? Both of you can work. That's what I think. In this economy, is that a picture of a gerbil? Oh my god, that's a picture of like a gerbil or a hamster. I, I love that. I love that. Yeah, guys, I think it's wonderful. Hey, kid. Friendly boy. My daddy's gone shopping. My mom has gone to work at the castle. I'm looking after the house while they're away. Aren't I a big boy? Uh, sure. Sure. Good job. You're... I mean, you got these leaks here. And you got your sword and in, 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 in waste. Um, what is this? Grocer Ares Blessing. Hello and welcome. Anything special? Uh, yes. Nickelodeon. Niggas kids. What should I make today? Hmm, I don't know if my wife will be back tonight. Oh. Like, does she, like, work overnight at the castle or something as well? Sounds like working at the castle could be busy work. Um... Okay, that means we can progress forward. I said forward like that, and Miss Pants was like, What the fuck is going on? Halt! Okay. The royal castle lies ahead. It lies? Why can't it be a truthful castle? The chapel is not open for worship at this time. If you are here to worship, come back later. Why are you so angry? Otherwise, you'd best leave. At ease. Lady Nell! That's right, calm the f*** down. So these guys... I, I mean... These gentlemen are... That's right, gentlemen. That's right. Gentlemen. We'll be going in now. Yes, yes ma'am. God, I love the respect she gets. Really cool to have a matriarchal... Um, uh, nation, because you don't see that often in video games. Like, even like Final Fantasy uh, Let 9, even though Braum rules We're that one place, it's not really a matriarchal. It's not like dominated by women, it's just like her. This is like apparently basically women, and that's cool. We're going to. Oh, you said that. Hmm. What's in there? Drugs. That's the chapel. Pilgrimages to Kadan, the holy land of Aparis, involve such a long and treacherous journey that most people just do their worshipping here, in the castle chapel, 
Fair enough. A chapel. If you're interested, go take a look later. Is it the Islamic faith where they go to like this big old area where there's like a massive like square within a square and they all like pilgrimage there? Because that's to me that's just insanely neat. Like to have that kind of faith, I, I don't have it. That's just nuts. Like in a good way for them. Just do that. It's admirable. The chamber is this way. Follow me. God, I love that she has two daggers. One's longer than the other. Really freaking cool, man. Hey, look at that weird bloom. <laughs> Alright, why are we walking so slow now? Can I not walk? Oh, I just have to hold out. Dude, I walk faster than Nell. Uh, are we going to any of these? Oh, they'll actually let me. Wow. Uh, runological weapon fabrication room? What? Wait, wait, what? I'm going up a ladder, ladies and gents. Runological weapon... Conquering channeled for concerning channeled force, applications of channeled force, methods of storing channeled force, the redeployment of channeled force. It looks like the same person wrote all these books. Author, Elena Fram. I wonder if we'll meet her. Wait, did we meet Elena yet? Wait, is there a person here? <gasps> Hello. Enthusiastic with us. But I am a runologist, I am many things I make much <laughs> I make much study and research weapons I create. I, I can't catch it. Singing like this really helps speed my work along. Incidentally, I wrote the lyrics and music to the song you just heard. I also arranged and performed it for you. I, it's entitled Working Women's Blues. I thought she was going to ask me for money. Okay, so I can't craft here. Gosh, damn, darn, damn it, Batman. We, we, will, we, uh, we will investigate this place later. I know. Can't you at least follow me when I ask? Well, let's not worry about that. Let's just get upstairs. I love that she comments on the fact that we didn't um, follow her. That is kind of amazing. Um, like, Oates and I have been playing Final Fantasy XIV together. I've been talking to you guys about that. Um, and we got to a section where a big old battle happens. Surprise, surprise. And people get hurt. Now, I'm playing a black mage, so fire, lightning, and ice. She's playing a white mage, a healer. And, um... When we, we were both talking to the same person in our own little cutscene, for me, they're like, come on, hold them down while I heal. And to her, they're like, aren't you a healer? Why aren't you helping? I was like, oh my god, they gave class-specific dialogue. That was really cool. We've been granted an audience with Her Majesty. Remember proper etiquette. Yeah, Cliff. Remember proper etiquette, Cliff. No calling her hot or not hot or whatever. I have returned, Your Majesty. But in all seriously, seriousness, I hope she has like a massive kind of like Pope hat or something. Or like big old shoulder pads that shoot up like from behind her to be like ridiculous. You have done well. Are these the ones? Heck is that behind him? Yes, Magistrate LaSalle. Lift your faces. Her Majesty will speak now. I mean, she's Listen got well to her words. Cool hair, I'll give her that. She's got like a nice veil. Face tattoo. Oh, I like that back hair thing. Welcome, Whoa. engineers of Greeton, to the sacred kingdom of Aquaria. Those eyeballs. I am the queen of this country, Romeria Zin Emuril. My name is Fate Line God. My name is Cliff Fitter, your majesty. I am deeply honored and grateful for this audience with your royal person. We have summoned you to this royal palace to request your assistance. As you may have heard, our country is at war with Aeriglyph. Glory to Aeriglyph! Still don't know what country those guys work for. And the war is not going well for Aquaria. The situation calls to mind Chapter 15 of Ecolos' Book of Prophecies, a book that contains the holy teachings of Apris. Ecolos' Book of Prophecies? Chaos in the Holy Land. The chaos shall spread catastrophe. Yes. And from that catastrophe shall be born a new maelstrom of war. It is our belief that this prophecy is about to come true. And we believe that you are the arrow of which the prophecy speaks. I am an arrow. Our country is now embroiled in a war with Aeriglyph. Unless something is done, 
Our innocent citizens shall perish. We beg of you to lend us your strength. Now, I will say this. I have my reservations because... Whilst we have seen the terribleness of Aeroglyph and how like horrific and brutal they can be and open to torture, um, this is also a heavily religious country, which I don't know if you guys have looked at history before, but those don't often work out well. So, um, we'll see. Please, your majesty. Got tiny hands. I don't know what we'll be able to do. We will do all we can. That is why we came here. Like that guy, can we trust him? Guard? That's a neat mask. Show the travelers from Greeton to the guest quarters. That is a cool mask. I like it. Yes, sir. Oh, soldier. You called a guard, but he's a soldier? Oh. Don't move. Who goes there? Reveal yourself. Slowly. Huh? Wait, you're that... I've seen you before. You live within our city walls. Is that the 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 nervous kid that the lady's like, you'll never marry? What are you doing here? Only authorized personnel are allowed at this point in the castle. It is. Please don't be so angry with me. So had I not spoken to him, would he be here? Does anybody know that? Let me know. Or would at least have changed the dialogue to be like, who's this bozo? But seriously, what are you doing here? Um, it, it's a a bit embarrassing. You see, I came to worship at the Great Temple, but I seem to have gotten lost on my way out. Sure you did. I've been wandering around here for quite some time. I'm sorry. I'll leave right away. Please forgive me. Came to worship? Yes, that's right. I'll be leaving now. Horse hockey. Stop that man. See a spy for Airy Glyph? I better have someone keep an eye on him. I remember hearing Farlene say she knew someone who was good at that sort of thing. That, that would be the best person to take care of this. Hmm. I should have told this guard. These are your quarters. Oh, voice acting's back. You may stroll around the castle as you wish. Oh, shucks! If you need something, ask the nearest soldier. I need some grapes and a cup of water with no ice, please. Thanks, pal. Oh, it's just like, that sounds lovely. We can buy grapes next time we go shopping, huh? If, yeah, if they're any good. They've been molding like a two days lately. So what are you going to do? What do you mean, do? You know, do. Are you going to stroll around the castle? Are you going to take a nap? Come on, fate, you're smarter than this. They said you could walk around the castle if you want to. I think I'm going to go check out the chapel. The chapel? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm an atheist myself, but I'm sort of interested in the art. Oh, that is so cool. The guy in a video game flat out just said, I'm an atheist. Like, you don't hear that kind of talk in video games. Usually the gods are so, like, present that they're like, by the power of Althena. I mean, Lunar was a great game, though, so I can't break. I can't fault it. You? Interested in art? Hey, don't laugh. I'm actually a bit of an artiste myself, although you wouldn't think it to look at me. See, I think Cliff is a better guy than he shows off to be. Like, he's doing really well to protect um, fate. And I think, like, his whole, like, oh, I hope they're hot is just, like, I don't know. Maybe he wants to seem cool, kind of like Roger. But Roger, I think, has his own different reasons. Um, I just hope both of them can grow out of it because it's, like, I get the whole pig-headed archetype and stuff. But, like, I know this game is 20 years old as well, but, like, still, like, it... it it's been done a lot before this game was made. Mirage said as much. Oh yeah, I miss Mirage. I wonder how she's doing. That's right. She said, you're the kind of guy who decides with his emotions before using his head. I don't think that's a compliment, Cliff. 
In other words, she thinks I'm an impressionist. It's not what that means, Cliff. I don't think that's what she meant. Damn right, fate. Yeah, she also said I'm always looking at pretty women, which I guess was her way of praising my keen sense of aesthetics. Don't you think? I think she actually has a thing for you, if I remember right. It kind of felt that way. Um. Ah, oh, Cliff, you're an idiot. Well, anyway, there you have it. Be back in a bit. Bye. That's how Frank always says bye to me. He goes, bye. But all righty, laddies and gentles, mans. This is where we are going to call this episode. And yes, that is another word that has an H in it. You're welcome for helping you know proper pronunciation of words. This has been Language Arts with Soulcrist. Hope you all had a good day. We will continue on in the next episode by um, looking around the castle. Take care of yourselves. But until next time, bye-bye for now. Eat corn. He's got the juices.